Alvik doesn't have the most sophisticated or upscale clientele, and I'm sure he's happy about that. At least they're not a raucous or unruly lot. Alvik keeps them in check. Fucking rebels causing trouble for everyone. What the hell are they thinking? Honor Hilaris is right. We're better off without them. There are mostly laborers and dock workers in this bar. It's the perfect cover for the resistance. I do miss old town. Mercury is just not the same without the magic ghetto. Shh. What? Well, take a look around you. Is this the best place to lament the loss of magicals? Well, we have lost something, haven't we? Is this town really better off without magicals? Be honest. Honesty is the quickest way to the noose. Ulvik told me once of the legend of the Onyx Cockerel, High King of all cocks. This proud fowl came to the aid of its owner when he was set upon by rabid man-eating owls. Unfortunately, the poor cockadoodle was torn to shreds. Owls. Light. Sharks of the skies. Their thirst for human blood is legendary. I do miss Old Town. Mercury is just not the same without the magic ghetto. Shh. What? Well, take a look around you. Is this the best place to lament the loss of magicals? Well, we have lost something, haven't we? Is this town really better off without magicals? They take their harvest the festival very seriously. Is the a whole month of excess, lips. culminating in the feast of reaping on Reap Moon's Eve. Have you found anything yet? I'm working on it. Enu and Nico are still out looking. And you're not. You should get to it. He's a mechanic, working on the pipe network. And he has a workbox with tools. They appear to be having a good time. Well deserved, too. They're good people. Bless their generous hearts. Those tubes will make our lives better. You wouldn't really? believe How's the that? amount of work well, there that's the, required uh, to keep the network well, running smoothly. Human oh, the engineering's right? good, what but the assembly. Well, Don't put military men tubes. on a civilian job, <laughs> is all I'm saying. This requires fine skill, not brute force. See, it, it, if the connection between the pipes are off by even a hair's breadth, the orbs can start rattling around and get stuck. If that happens, Shadow, let's just say the tower would be severely displeased. The official opening's in a week, 
and they want the ceremony to go as smoothly as possible. The emissary would not take kindly to being embarrassed in front of the first. So that leaves me and the work box. <coughs> uh, oh. A work box. That's probably where a mechanic would keep his tools. You're the only one not out there looking for a solution, Kian. That probably won't play well with the team. There's food left on the table. This pipe has a hinged panel in it, but I'll need a tool to open it.
stacks of hay to represent the harvest festival, the reaping. This is an historical landmark of some sort. Shepard mentioned the name Abnaxis, an ambassador of the Vanar, she said. It's locked. I could probably force it open, but I have no business in there. I'm surprised we didn't tear it down, but I guess there's nothing outwardly pagan about this building. It's just a hollowed out, petrified tree. It's locked. I could probably force it open, but I have no business in there. Who's there? Since the raid on Old Town, they've sectioned off more of the city at night. You can pass, but you need to answer questions. There's official Azadi business going on here. You'll want to turn around and walk away.
My veil won't work if I approach the guards and speak to them. They'll see me, and they'll have questions. These gates are kept closed after sundown. Since the raid on Old Town, they've sectioned off more of the city at night. You can pass, but you need to answer questions. My veil won't work if I approach the guards and speak to them. They'll see me, and they'll have questions. It's surprisingly quiet out. Usually these tables are busy until late at night. Granted it is chilly and damp. Everyone's probably inside, carousing. That's probably a maintenance hatch, but it's locked. The wreaths are part of the harvest festival tradition. Those paper dragons are illegal. They've been arresting anyone caught running them, but new ones pop up every day. 
supporters of the magical resistance fly paper dragons to remind people of the balance and the dry kin. It's a powerful symbol. They're beautiful, and the runners are brave. Foolhardy, but brave. Anyone there? A crate full of angled pipe sections. Elbows, if I'm not mistaken. Pipe sections. Surplus or spare parts, I imagine. The ghetto's been burned to the ground. Whatever's left in there, it's ruins. Hello? Hello? I envy those who can shut their doors at night and find peace inside. But that's why we fight, so that they can shut their doors and forget. Behind every window there are stories. Honor Hilaris has posted these bills everywhere. He's serious about his run for office. Under his leadership, the city watch will fester and rot. The harbour master answers to the council, but all ships that dock here need a letter of permission from the emissary's office. So, in effect, the tower controls the harbour. Without that proud cock and the delightful little puss riding on it, the resistance would be in a dark place indeed. I... Oh, goddess, forgive me, I keep doing that. The rooster and kitten's been a safe harbour for us. I hope we can properly repay Ulvik after this is all over.
A single bob won't hurt. I'm sure no one's watching. Ah, this brings me back. Although without the nettles, something's definitely lost. Barrel bobbing. There's a tradition we also have in Azadir. Of course, we didn't use apples. We used nettles. They stung fiercely, and the children would cry. It was enjoyable. Are those yams? No, they're only apples. Oh. A single bob won't hurt. I'm sure no one's watching. A pumpkin. An odd vegetable, native to the Northlands. We have nothing like it in Azadir. In a world with yams, who needs apples? I know Bip's been tearing down these bills, but National Front supporters keep replacing them. There appear to be a lot of them skulking in the shadows. Who's Is there? there a ghost? Just leave me be! These gates are kept closed after sundown. Since the raid on Old Town, they've sectioned off more of the city at night. You can pass, but you need to answer questions.
Goat eats leaves. Goat falls asleep. Interesting. Wait, I remember someone talking about this a while back. A mole, was it? Goat eats leaves. Goat falls asleep. Interesting. Wait, I remember someone talking about this a while back. A mole, was it? What was that herb the mole spoke of? Evensong. This must be it. It's an opiate. Consume enough and you fall asleep. What exactly are you doing to that goat? Wait, does this have anything to do with why you rejected me? Goats? Honestly? What do you mean by goats and honestly? I don't understand your words, woman. Hey, I'm not judging anyone. I'm just surprised is all. Where have you been this past month? Away. Far away. Travelling, so... Uh... This goat, what's going on here? It's rebel business. Clearly. How's that working out for you? Are you one of them now? I'm atoning for my sins. Right. But you are enjoying it. I don't enjoy fighting my own people. Well, you seem to be good at it. Word is the Resistance is gaining support, that people have hope now that you're there. I'm doing what I can to help. I heard you executed our vile little Azadi officer. I don't disapprove, I'm just wondering why you didn't extract information before ending his life. I mean, if you're gonna kill him anyway, What's a little pain and blood to start things off with? The thing about torture is that it's a seal of authenticity. It makes every piece of information more... reliable. I understand your friends didn't take the officer's word for it. Well, even if you didn't pull out of Old Town, at least the Resistance put up a decent fight before... The important thing is, many Azadi died that night. Chalice half-full and all that. What do you want? Nothing. Nothing. I saw you. It's been a while. I wanted to say hello. Ah, oh, I've missed this. The one-sided conversations, the sullenness and suspicion. I've come to enjoy it quite a bit. Anyway, goats? We have a lead on the pipes. Oh, that explains everything. I'll leave you to it then. I'm going to the rooster later tonight. I need to speak with Olvik. Maybe I'll see you there. Maybe. This is what I love about you, Keon. You're such a people person. This is Evensong. It works on goats. Well, then it should work on the Azadi too, eh? One more ale on the house, da? Ah, what a lovely head. This one smells different. Malty, sweet. It's almost like the sugar ale from Southern as a day. Now, this is a brew, Vic. It tastes like home, this does. 
It brings tears to my eyes. It's simply spect... He's dead to the world, knocked out by Evensong. If I ever have trouble sleeping again, I'll know what to do. Don't take too long out there. If he wakes up without his tools, there'll be questions and I won't have any good answers. Before our arrival, the street lamps were lit with magic spells. They've been replaced with modern electricity. It's empty. There's a strong current of air flowing through it. There's air flowing from right to left, like a tempest in a tube. There's a powerful wind blowing from right to left, and it carries something with it. Too quick to see, too fast to grab. There's a powerful wind blowing from right to left, and it carries something with it. Too quick to see, too fast to grab. I'll lose my fingers if I try and grab it. It's solid, and it's swift.
A single bob won't hurt. I'm sure no one's watching.
They've put up ornaments all over town for the festival of reaping. Harvest season is important in the Northlands.